On entering the community of Zimbabwe, Arnett Gardens, where two siblings were this week shot up by unknown assailants over what initial media reports claimed was the elder daughter's refusal to sexual demands by dons in the area, early Sunday morning, there was visible tension. There is a very thick crowd now gathered outside the house where 17-year-old Michelle and her 12-year-old sister were reportedly shot and injured, Michelle, of course, fatally. And so right now the residents are disgruntled because they're saying that the media initially reported something that was not so. Yeah, and I broke the house and I took over the TV and I took over the ceiling down. I would but some of them take out. Yeah. Some of them free now. Some of them are white and I'm like, I'm not something. I'm not going to go to the house. I'm not going to go to the house. So this lady comes up with me and tell you about it. I'm going to get rid of it now. I'm going to pay that to go. Make sure you get. No, I'm not this girl. This is the girl. Why two men are these things? But still, she's nobody. Nobody is a girl. She's a woman, man. Come here and kill her pinnacle. She I tell the pinnacle himself, but tell the man say she's not here. I she she has, I to and I live in them, she see if she ever tell her anytime she and a man, I promise she put her pity them in it. The residents insisted on the mother of the two girls who was for minutes locked away with the Prime Minister and other political representatives Tuesday to come forward and set the record straight, especially with heightened police presence. Them get reports they are being raped up here. So them have to kill the rape of them. We want this clear for the rape and the rape on the boy here. And we don't want the police them kill no more. We need the man them, because we don't kill the man them, we want to turn to them, right? We need the man them too. So them can't kill the man them and left here, woman here. They rape on the boy here. We need the man them, them and tell them, them to clear out that out of the air and take that off of Facebook. And they have to sue cleaner too. Come tell them about people. Who cleaner? Who be cleaner? And as it concerns claims that Dons were operating in their community. The residents claim about the alleged misinformation in the initial reports by some media entities was corroborated by their local representatives. The media covered it initially in a particular way and ascribed a certain motive, which I think was very unpopular in the community because they felt that that was not the case and it was painting the community in a bad light. I don't know whether that has had an impact on what you're hearing around. Um, the truth is that we don't yet know, the police do not yet know what was the reason for this horrible, horrible murder. And um, until they do know, there's no real point and if one should avoid trying to speculate. Nika Lewis, CVM Live.